Hello, we are a coalition of stakeholders here to introduce initiatives that we are confident will enhance Walgreens' environmental efforts, particularly related to our oceans. The team we have presenting these important issues is comprised of three different stakeholders, society, the government, and your suppliers. We are three of your company's most prominent stakeholders, and we are dedicated to making Walgreens as competitive and respectable as possible. Society is significantly impacted by the actions and choices Walgreens makes. Our response to practices and environmental actions have the power to either enhance or damage Walgreens' reputation and brand image as a whole. Due to this, on behalf of the societal stakeholder group for your company, holding legal and economic power within Walgreens, I believe it is imperative that your company continues to strive towards a sustainable development agenda as a way to continue to differentiate yourselves. Pollution is an integral issue, and in order to progress, progress to be made, it is crucial that we start initiating the change we want to see by taking responsibility, starting with your company to inspiring others. The government is a dominating body in society, and on their behalf, I'm here to tell you that Walgreens is capable of making environmentally conscious decisions before we are forced to intervene in the form of legislation. As the environment continues to degrade, we will need to enact carbon emission, among other regulations, which can negatively impact your company. This is why I am here today, to try and convince you to be proactive in implementing changes prior to these restrictions being enforced. If you were to enact sustainable efforts in the near future, it will give your company a competitive advantage, as you will only need to make minor adjustments to meet new environmental standards that are passed, while companies who wait to respond will be forced to undergo major operational adjustments. As I am sure you are aware, your suppliers are salient stakeholders in your company. We are proud to be the people filling your shelves of your store, but alongside that responsibility, we also have opinions which we think will better Walgreens' overall image. The decisions your company makes in regards to environmental issues significantly impact our production, and as a provider for your company, we want to make sure we are enhancing the environment rather than polluting it. Therefore, I am here on the behalf of the suppliers as a stakeholder of your company with economic and informational power with, within Walgreens. Yeah. The three of us have diverse relationships with Walgreens, who we are able to unite over our shared interests of helping Walgreens create the best possible sustainable outcomes, especially in terms of our oceans and life underwater. For this reason, it is very natural for us to form a coalition to strengthen our viewpoints on this pointed topic of global sustainability. As the oceans continue to deteriorate, the need for change is extremely urgent, and that is why we are here today to present you with ideas to help you better your business and sustainability efforts, which will allow your company to flourish now and in the future. As a large global company, Walgreens has the power to inspire positive social change. Our ocean ecosystems and marine biology are at great risk, and we believe that a few new practices can be enacted to help reduce ocean pollution and acidification. The oceans are a major source of the global economy, with a market value of over $3 trillion. Because over half the population depends on oceans, it is crucial that they are managed more effectively. Upon a review of Walgreens press releases, we are happy to see that your outward public stance has an emphasis on sustainability. We believe that Walgreens truly does have a concern for the environment and wants to ensure that they are running their business as responsibly as possible. This is encouraging to see and leads us to believe that Walgreens would be willing to improve even more in this respect, as we will outline going forward. However, we recognize that Walgreens, as any other business, has the paramount priority to earn money and continue to turn a solid profit. We do not intend to infringe upon this important aspect of business as financial stability is essential in keeping a company's operations alive. Rather, explain the importance of environmental sustainability for our planet and implore you to consider our advice. We also appreciate that Walgreens has already started multiple environmental initiatives. However, none so far has specifically addressed the well-being of the oceans. Keeping all of this in mind, we feel that there is a way for Walgreens to continue to maintain a profitable business while also prioritizing environmental sustainability. Making Walgreens a business everyone from executives to cashiers is proud to be a part of. To propose a few measures for you to consider in regard to the United Nations 14 Sustainable Development Goal, which speaks on the issue of ocean pollution and acidification. We are aware that at Walgreens, you value efficiency and keeping your customers happy and recognize that these are important standards in maintaining your business. In response to realizing your customers focus on disposing medication safely rather than sustainably, you reacted by implementing medication disposals in over 600 stores to enhance and further promote the company's devotion to its sustainability efforts. This process entails customers dropping their medication in a metal box where it is then transported to Stericycle where it is safely incinerated. This secure process has proven to be a success as it has collected more than 155 tons of unwanted medication in the first 18 months. 
Effectively responding to customers' actions with a means of enhancing sustainability is a positive indicator that Walgreens is capable of minimizing the levels of ocean pollution. Additionally, in 2016, Walgreens Boots Alliance was honored with the United Nations Foundational Global Leadership Award, which recognized the company's ongoing commitment to corporate social responsibility, as well as sustainable development goals. We are also aware that you have implemented programs, specifically at WE Day, that encourage and enforce employees to take part in small changes in order to start saving the world. Walgreens is capable of turning the tides on the plethora of plastic waste to reduce its footprint on Earth. Each year, an estimated 18 billion pounds of plastic waste enters the world's oceans from coastal regions. This is a very alarming statistic. As a retail distributor of numerous products that come in plastic bags and casings, as well as one that gives customers plastic shopping bags, Walgreens is responsible for a portion of this issue. For this reason, our call to action is for Walgreens to tax plastic bags and limit waste from pharmaceutical production. There is concrete proof that imposing a tax on plastic bags can serve a dual purpose. A, generating revenue that can be put towards another initiative or future investment, and B, it can lead to a significant reduction in plastic bag consumption. As previously mentioned, plastic waste is a common item found in oceans. Not only does this cause general pollution, but it also leads to the death of many marine organisms as they mistake plastic for food. To combat this issue, a state of Colorado representative, Paul Rosenthal, recently proposed a plastic bag tax for the state to enact. This is in response to many significant cities in Colorado experiencing success with their own tax thus far. Boulder, for example, has been charging 10 cents per paper and plastic bag since 2013, and within the year this began, non-reusable bag use dropped by 69% in the city. Rosenthal's proposal is for a 25-cent tax and is planning on pledging this revenue generated to build and retain affordable housing. He believes this can raise upwards of $50 million a year. On behalf of the Coalition of Society and the Government, we recommend issuing a tax between 10 and 20 cents per plastic bag. This tax money can be directed to fund other proposals or can be used to further expand the company. Employees will also benefit from this as they will be proud of the company they work for as it prioritizes not just profit, but helping to develop a sustainable environment. This small change can help reduce ocean pollution significantly and it is a rather easy policy to enforce without causing any groundbreaking changes to the fundamental model of the business. This will reserve the interests of your other stakeholders. Toxic waste from pharmaceutical production directly affects our oceans and rivers. Discharges from manufacturing plants leave active pharmaceutical ingredients in our oceans. The presence of APIs is toxic to marine organisms. There has been recent research in the past five years which suggests that contamination from pharmaceutical pollution is very high. Scientists predict that the excretion of these APIs promotes the development of harmful drug-resistant microorganisms, and this type of pollution directly affects, impacts society, one of the Walgreens' key shareholders. Walgreens has already taken action to limit pollution of oceans caused from unused medications with their kiosks. However, they have not tackled the more serious problem of pollution from excretion of pharmaceutical waste at factories. 30 to 90 percent of the active pharmaceutical ingredients found in human waste enter sewage systems and eventually end up in rivers and then oceans, which contaminates the water and kills marine life. Eliminating this waste is vital to restoring and sustaining the health of our planet. We believe Walgreens should buy from pharmaceutical manufacturing companies that are committed to going green and focusing on better sustainability efforts. GlaxoSmithKline is working towards the both reducing waste and using waste as a source of renewable energy. Another company in China, AstraZeneca, has focused on preventing the release of APIs that end up in our oceans. They have created a technology that treats metallic contaminated water that extracts 99% of the API to avoid pollution moving onward from sewage system to rivers and eventually onto the ocean. The process is fully automated and has minimal environmental effects. With steady innovations like these, pharmaceutical manufacturers are on their way to reducing pollution. With this, we believe it is imperative for Walgreens to begin buying from pharmaceutical producers that prioritize environmentally friendly technology. Although this will lead to a slight increase in production costs, Walgreens will experience a higher volume of sales, which will increase profits as well as help offset damage to the ocean. With our proposals, suppliers could be both opposed and for the changes depending on which side of the issue they are on. Additionally, these implementations benefit society because they will improve the health of the community if there is less pollution and encourages the well-being of future populations. We cannot afford the future degradation of the ocean. The government can also benefit from our call to action if they impose monetary penalties for production facilities that don't adhere to the restriction in laws. 
Employees and customers would both be for the changes, and they're inherently doing their part in addressing the issue by choosing to work and shop at environmentally friendly businesses. In summary, there are no any, there are not any stakeholders that are against the proposed changes because pollution affects everyone in a harmful way. There are no long-term benefits of pollution and needs to be reduced in order to fight the issue of climate change. With sustainability becoming an extremely prevalent issue, a variety of companies have began taking steps to alter their business schemes in order to combat global warming and other environmental issues. Generating practices to help mitigate these issues may be costly, especially in the production of pharmaceuticals as this alters current supply costs. However, their impact in the long run will both exceed the cost financially as well as help Walgreens enhance their reputation and furthering their impetus for being a leader in local and global changes. You have the power to set off a chain reaction in the business world by continuing your current efforts as well as implementing the initiatives we have proposed. We hope you strongly consider our recommendations and understand your impact on the environment as well as the rest of the business world who will view your company as the standard for a premier sustainable model to follow because you not only turn in a huge annual profit but also strive to make a difference each and every day. Thank you for your time. The change starts, starts with, with you. you.